Hey guys, the JSON tutorials are not over yet, but I just had to throw this in because it seems like some people are raising concerns in the comment sections of my videos. So I want to just squish this. When creating AJAX driven web applications, JavaScript developers lose the indexing power that their content would normally have if it were regular HTML visible in the source code of the document. This is why a lot of webmasters choose to not use AJAX and JavaScript to supply any important text or image content to the viewer in any way. The browser software and the viewer can access your AJAX content, but the search engine crawlers cannot yet. Most search engine crawlers can only crawl HTML content. If you supply any text, images, lists, database data, or anything else through AJAX, the crawlers will not be able to execute the AJAX request and thus they will not index your precious site content. So the same issue that Flash developers used to face is now plaguing Ajax application developers and JavaScript animation programmers. Technology leaders created crawlers that could index a Flash SWF file by programming the search engine bots to access the active object plugin on the page. But search engine technology leaders have not yet made such efforts for JavaScript and Ajax powered web content to enable their bots to crawl that content by default. The developer has to take extra steps. So we have to take extra steps at this point in time until search engine technology leaders make the crawlers access Ajax and JavaScript driven content by default, making it to where we do not have to take any extra steps to assure that our site content is indexed well. They did it for Flash years ago and I imagine they will do the same thing for JavaScript content to where hopefully soon we don't have to take any extra steps to have our JavaScript and Ajax content be well indexed in all of the search engines. For the time being, the solution we have is creating an HTML snapshot to feed to the search engine crawlers. It's a pain in the butt, yes, but it must be done if you care about your very dynamic and cool site indexing well in search engines. Your site might be HTML based, but if any content is delivered through Ajax or JavaScript, you are suffering on the SEO side of things unless you work with HTML snapshots. I'm going to supply you guys with this link to the Google Developer website under the Webmaster section for Ajax crawling. And I'll put this link in the video's description. That way you guys can just check out the video description and click the link if you want to come to this page. So you can see what Google says. If you're running an Ajax application with content that you'd like to appear in search results, we have a new process that, when implemented, can help Google and potentially other search engines crawl and index your content. You just go ahead and click on all of these sections to become very well educated on what you can do to make your Ajax and JavaScript content more accessible to search engine crawlers. And actually other search engines like Yahoo and Bing are adopting Google's method for crawling Ajax and JavaScript driven content. So the solution is HTML snapshots and I hope that helps some of you guys. We've known this for years. We've known that content in Flash doesn't index well for years. That's why a lot of developers didn't like using Flash. They prefer to use regular HTML even though it wasn't fancy and all animated. It was very indexable in the search engines. And you have the same problem when you're using JavaScript and Ajax to deliver any kind of content to your viewer.